A child having to undergo any type of surgery is traumatic. For children with early onset scoliosis, it used to require surgery every six months to straighten their spine. Now, Jessica Cartaya reports on a scoliosis breakthrough that's changing children's lives. 4th of July 2015, Garrett King was just seven years old when he came down with a low grade fever. Normal, everyday kid playing soccer. Within hours, Garrett was rushed to Johns Hopkins, where he slipped into a month long coma. As a result of his illness, he developed scoliosis, a curvature of the spine and the most common spinal deformity in school aged children. At that point, he was his body was curved. Approximately 3 million childhood cases are diagnosed in the U.S. each year, with 29,000 scoliosis surgeries performed annually. It was actually pushing his left hip out of socket. Treatment used to require metal rods be placed in a child's back to straighten their spine. But now, at just 10 years old, Garrett is still growing, and that would have required multiple surgeries to keep up with his body. But new technology being used by Johns Hopkins orthopedic surgeon Dr. Paul Sponseller is changing the way early onset scoliosis is treated. So this technology allows growth to happen and even to be driven uh, without repeated surgery. How much of an improvement is this technology for your patients? A really cool, uh, eye-opening, game-changing, transformative advance in care of children with young growing spine disorders. In February, Dr. Sponseller inserted titanium rods into Garrett's spine. There's a small incision down here and another small incision way up here where the rods were inserted and they were slipped from bottom to top and then anchored at both ends and they hold his spine straight. The rods are able to stretch and expand internally. Now, instead of having multiple surgeries, Garrett comes every few months to Johns Hopkins for a distraction, where Dr. Sponseller uses a locator to find the magnets. Is it okay if we make you taller? Yeah. Okay. A special external remote controller activates tiny magnetic motors in the rod and stretches Garrett's spine by about five millimeters. Did that feel okay? Did that bother you? No. They go ahead and adjust his rods, lengthen the rods as needed, and we're in and out of here within 15 to 20 minutes. Garrett's spine curvature is already improving, and he'll continue to have magnetic lengthening until he stops growing. Personality-wise, he's still the same person. It's just the physical aspect oh, of it. Look who's at the finish line! Dr. Sponseller performs approximately 150 scoliosis surgeries every year.